Before you begin your kettlebell workout, it's a good idea to perform some muscle activation exercises. Now the biggest muscle in the body, and probably one of the most important muscles when you're training with kettlebells, is the buttocks, or the glutes as we call them. Now often, people have got inactive glutes because they spend a lot of time sitting down. And they become, um, basically they switch off and they find it a lot more difficult to activate correctly. So we start to compensate and use other muscles. So in order to get them fired up, get them excited, what we do is a few activation muscles before we start training. So I'm going to show you two, two exercises. The first one is just simply buttock clenches. So from here, feet just a little bit closer than shoulder width apart. And you're just going to literally push the hips forward and really pinch your buttocks nice and tight. I often say to my clients and people in my kettlebell classes that we're trying to crack a walnut between our, our butt cheeks. So really pinch them nice and tight, hold, and then relax. And then pinch again, nice and tight, pushing the hips forwards, and then relax. You'll probably feel your core muscles switch on as well as you push those hips forward and pinch your buttocks. Just do 10 reps of that and that'll get them nicely warmed up and get them used to switching on. Second exercise is the bridge. So let's go down to the mat and I'll show you how to do these. So you're going to lie on your back, hands in the air and pull your heels underneath. This way. From here, you're going to push up from your heels, push the hips up into the air and at full extension you're going to squeeze those buttocks nice and tight. Pinch for three seconds. Relax, bring the buttocks down. Don't rest on the floor, just touch and then come back up again. Pinch nice and tight and come back down. Most importantly, don't overextend through the lower back this way. Remember all the movement comes from the hips. So you want to push the hips towards the sky rather than lower back. Pinch nice and tight and down you come. Again, 10 repetitions of the bridge will also get those buttocks firing. So, you can do your bum clenches, your buttock clenches, and you can also do 10 of the bridges. That'll get things switched on, and you'll be ready to start your workout.